I picked up my new Ford Maverick on January 23rd, 2023. That means I have had it for a little over four months now. It's time for a review. I'll be honest with you, I was hesitant. I'm a conservative and do not buy this story of electric vehicles being the savior of the globe. But the hybrid Maverick was the only towable pickup I could find that was light enough to pull behind my Sprinter. When I determined it was not a plug-in hybrid, I decided to give it a try. Four months later, I will tell you, I made the right move. I am delighted with my Maverick. For videos on how I found it and modifications I have made to it, you can look at the playlist right up there. Let's start with performance. I drive entirely in normal. I am experiencing over 41 miles to the gallon. More on that later. I know that some folks drive in eco trying to get even better economy, but I found it sluggish and I'm happy with 41 miles per gallon. I saw one guy on Facebook that said he always drove in low for the same reason. Sports mode was peppier, but I feel no need for it. I am happy and normal. I love my interior. I have the blacked out Larry. The console, dash, and doors all have great places to store things. Under the back seat is also great storage. The truck has nice exterior lines, and I added a decal on the front fender. I also added lettering to the tailgate. The three-fold bed cover adds security and does not leak. Then there is size. I have seen the controversy about is it a truck or is it a car. I have even heard it referred to as a truckette. I understand it's not a massive utility work truck for the construction site, but it is all the truck I need. My first pickup was a 1973 Toyota. I think it was smaller than my Maverick. Over the years, I have owned mostly F-150s, but did have a Frontier for a while. The F-150s started out a very nice size, with my favorite being a 20,000 step size. Then they just kept getting bigger, too big. My last pickup was in 2013 when I got a two-door Jeep Wrangler Sport as a tow vehicle behind an RV. I missed my pickups. I have pulled my Maverick beside a Tacoma, a Frontier, and a Santa Cruz. The others may stand a little taller, but they are basically the same size. Since I have owned my Maverick, I have hauled fuel for the lawnmower, lumber, a chest, a new miter saw, and even a barrel. All very efficient. Back to fuel economy. At first I watched it closely. Too closely. I had to stop and pay attention to traffic. Now I just drive, and as I said, I am over 41 miles to the gallon. I wave at folks in the gas stations as I go by. I bought the Maverick because I could tow it behind an RV. It tows like a dream. I even save fuel when the MAV is not even running. I will do a video on that soon and will put a link up top when I do. The only thing about my new truck I do not like is the seat belt alert that shows up in the dash and has to be turned off every time, even when the seat belts are connected. I guess that's a small price to pay. On a scale of 1 to 10, I will give my Maverick a 9.9. .9.